our collaboration started some years ago on this project, Story Places, and it was Jay and I, and also a faculty member in African American Studies, Lois Brown. What we've shown most recently is actually a, a shorter version of the longer work that's a part of this New England Dance on Tour initiative. I was the music director or music consultant. I composed the music first. It was kind of built on this familial history and then uh, this whole idea of urban and rural roots mm -hmm. to urbanity in the 20th century. From West African, specifically kind of Guinea styles, to Afro-Cuban, uh, Afro-Haitian, and Afro-Brazilian styles that already bring with them the history of the people who do them. And so we, as a group, tapped into those as our physical language. It's been an interesting process working in a collaboration. I've become more aware of kind of the interaction of composer with choreographer, director, mm -hmm conceptualist writer. I learned a lot about how mm -hmm. the movement tells a story without the text. Mm -hmm. You get the meaning or the, the signification of something from the movement itself. One of the wonderful structures here on campus is that we do have a Center for the Arts in these beautiful spaces that are there and available and supportive of faculty work. Wesleyan has really distinguished itself by this deeply creative interdisciplinary process that engages the faculty, the students, the staff. So there's kind of a multi-layered and tiered kind of collaboration that I think is unique for us.